it is Thursday, November 17th. Welcome back to the vlog. So the show was awesome. It was so awesome. It was so awesome that now I need a nap. Do you remember how after Nerds and Music I was like, oh my god, it was so amazing and my arms were flailing everywhere and I was really high pitched and like had so much caffeine in me that it was almost shooting out of my pores as beams of light? Um, I am still that way, but on the inside because today my outside looks like this and is really tired and in need of a nap. But it was amazing. I loved every second of that show. I loved every second of getting to work in the merch booth, which was super fun and super awesome. And I loved every second of getting to hang out with my friends afterwards, which was really, really great. And the whole evening was really, really fun. I also had really good food at the teriyaki place across the street from the Aladdin. They say that they're the best teriyaki in Portland. And you know what? They really are. They are. It was really yummy. You get a lot of food for not a lot of money, but this post is not about that. This post is about going to Woodstock Presents Paul and Storm vs. Will Wheaton featuring the double clicks. And I think it's safe to say that if you ever get a chance to see something like that, you should definitely go because they all work so hard to put on a really good show. And it was a really good show. Even the one guy who had to shout out some dickish comment about Storm's shirt looking like it came from Walmart. Like, really? You have one chance to shout something out and that's what you say? Really? But, you know, there's always one in every crowd. And it just makes it easier to appreciate all of the people who are not dicks at shows like that. That's how I choose to look at it. You could look at it as, wow, that guy was really rude and eh. But I choose to look at it as, well, the person next to me is behaving wonderfully. Isn't that nice? That's great. I, I hope that's a healthy way to look at things. <laughs> Works for me, especially when I'm tired and I need a nap. So... It was great. I will probably be writing about it on my blog in the next few days, hopefully. I said that after the last thing, and I still haven't done it. But hopefully soon I will be writing about it on the blog. And now I'm going to go take a nap. And I'm going to get back to work. And then I'm going to get back to NaNoWriMo, because I'm days behind on it because of my eye thing. And it's very hard to go back to regular life after events like Wootstock and Nerd Tribe time. It's, it's just hard to be normal the next day. I don't know what it is. But I'm going to go try. And I urge you to all not do the same, you know? Figure out what makes you happy and go do that. And if your happiness is taking a nap like mine is about to be, more power to ya. So I will talk to you all again tomorrow. Thank you as always for watching. I always very, very much appreciate it. And that's it for today. See you tomorrow.